You know, overnight, six people were taken to the hospital after a police chase that happened in North St. Louis County. Yeah, police say it all started because report of a stolen vehicle. News 4's Alex Gall live to break down what we learned overnight from police. Alex. Yeah, good morning, Claire and Mo. This is the intersection where the crash happened and that chase ended last night. Lindbergh going this way, Whitehall Manor the other way. And you can see some of the debris back there behind me that is still left over from this crash that happened at about 10 p.m. last night. Now, six total people were injured in this, all of them expected to be okay. Two of them cops, four of them apparently just caught in the middle of this. You're looking at video now of the crash scene just afterwards last night. Bridgeton police say the chase started about two miles north of here. Police got called out to Walmart for a stolen vehicle and they found it nearby on St. Charles Rock Road. While pulling it over, the car suddenly took off, ramming into two police cars in the process. The chief says officers fired at the suspect, but no one was hit. The car made it here to Lindbergh and Whitehall Manor, where it crashed into two vehicles. The suspect was arrested, and four people in those cars needed hospital treatment. That's in addition, again, to the two officers who the Bridgeton police chief said were released from the hospital overnight. Now, police say that they will present this case to the prosecutor's office here in St. Louis County later on today. We'll have more coming up on News 4 at 6. Claire and Mo. All right, thank you, Alex. This is.